training and getting prepared ready for December 15th and I'm in camp there all the way till the fight um, 10 weeks in alliance with some of the best fighters in the world and yeah I'm going in to this fight and I want a stand up fight I'm training I'm going to be I'm taking this fight as if it's going to be an all stand up fight um, that's where I want the fight that's where I'm keeping the fight and that's where the activity is going to be you know um, obviously don't get me wrong this is a mixed martial arts fight anything can happen but yeah, the fight's going to be a stand-up fight. He ain't take me down. He can't take me down. He might try, and he'll fail. Um, so yeah, it's going to be a stand-up fight, and it's going to be a high pace. I'm going to be in great shape. Um, I don't have a big, huge weight cut to think about. I just come in healthy, strong, fit, fast, and hungry to fight. You know, and all the emotions that we've had doing the show, all this bullshit talk that we talk now before the fight it all means something when it comes December 15th you know I, I finally get to put them gloves on and punch them you know and get paid for doing it and that's what I can't wait to do um, I'm excited for this camp I'm excited to go back to 155 and I'm excited to fight George um, I've got bad feelings towards George We've, I think he doesn't like me I don't like him we're two completely different type of people and as the show goes on you'll see us not liking each other more and more so yeah it's going to be a good fight um, <clears throat> I think the fans are going to enjoy watching this fight and uh, yeah make sure the referees fast referee because uh, I'm not going to stop once I knock them out I'm keep going um, it means something to me this fight it means a lot and I want this win I want this win it's definitely a little bit more personal. There's a lot more meaning. It's not just an ordinary opponent. It's not just someone from the UFC roster. It, it means something to us. This is, this is going to be real, you know? I'm not going in there to compete against this guy. I'm going in there to hurt this guy, you know? I have feelings where I physically want to hurt this guy. And I've not had that in the UFC before. I've never felt like that towards another opponent. Yes, I've wanted to win. Yes, I've wanted to knock the guy out. Yes, I've wanted to succeed. But I've never had a, emotions towards a guy where I really don't like him and I've got reason not to like him. So yeah, it's gonna be the real Ross Pearson come December 15th. Yeah, this is MMA, of course. I'm gonna be prepared for any situation. Yeah, what I'm seeing is I have more skills in mixed martial arts than what he does. He may have more skills than me in BJJ. That's one advantage he has over me. But the skills that I have is not being able to put the fight where he wants the fight. I've got the skills to keep the fight where I want the fight and put the fight anywhere. If I wanted to take him down, I can take him down. He wants to take me down, he can't take me down. You know, He wants to stand with me, it's great for me. That's where I come from. He doesn't want to stand with me. He hasn't been hit by me, he doesn't know what real stand-ups about you know he might see he trains with professional boxers he he doesn't know he's going to find out december 15th